The Naginata is a martial art with a long history, a cherished tradition that has been passed down without cessation for centuries. Developed as a battle weapon in times of old, the Naginata was used widely in warfare as far back as the Heian period. By the time of the Edo period, it had become a self-defense tool with a formalized style meant to train the warrior spirit. In the Meiji period, it became popular as a martial art practiced primarily by women. After World War II, it came to be seen as an art both men and women could practice, regardless of their age. As a martial art that builds physical and mental discipline, instills a sense of morality, courtesy, and respect for others, Naginata plays an important role in both schools and community settings. The International Naginata Federation was formed in 1990. Aficionados have increased not only in Japan, but also around the world. Though there have been many Naginata styles over the years, most of these have been lost to the tides of time. The Jikishin Kage Ryu Naginata style is distinguished by its emphasis on practicality. This style takes its cue from the powerful flow of energy observed in natural phenomena, such as water and wind, and this is integrated into its techniques. Movement, as it is expressed in nature, forms the basis for this style. Thus, the greatest force is brought forth, utilizing the least amount of effort. Characteristic of the techniques of the Tendoryu style are the switching of the hands, strength of legwork, and the spreading of the feet. The secret is to maintain a spirit of perseverance rather than push for perfection. Master the techniques, nurture the spirit of harmony, have unshakable conviction and a respectful mind. Develop sincere humility. Technique is brought to life when the body and the mind become one. That is the way of the Naginata. Everything begins with the basics. Standing at ease while holding the naginata is called shizentai, the natural stance. Bowing is an expression of one's sense of humility and lends itself to a purity of intent and a posture of beauty. Kamae, the ready state, is simultaneously a guard against an opponent's advance and the starting point for one's own attack. The five basic kamae are the high position, the middle position, the low position, at the side, and the shakahasso. These allow one to switch freely between offense and defense in response to any action taken by an opponent. One must be prepared both in body and mind as the kamae position is taken. 
The stroke of the naginata must be precise. Its arching blade swung upward, sideways, or diagonally. Being always aware of the path of the blade, one coordinates one's body movements with it. Swinging up, down, diagonally, and horizontally in succession is called hapo buri, multi-directional swinging. Proper swinging of the blade is practiced at different speeds, sometimes fast, sometimes gently. Methods of striking include an upswing strike, re-gripping for a strike, and continuous striking. All striking or stabbing is done with total commitment, the naginata being wielded with appropriate posture and combat form. One should put all one's vigor behind every strike. Following a strike, one must swiftly return to a stance of readiness without a moment's hesitation. This is called zanshin, a state of relaxed alertness. The arrangement of basic movements and techniques into formalized sequences is called shikake oji, initiation and response. The shikake is the one who initiates an offensive technique, while the oji is the one who responds with a defensive technique. Both shikake and oji commence with a state of constant preparedness and a proper bearing. The shikake moves to throw the opponent off guard, driving in to strike when their defense has been compromised. In response, the oji parries with the naginata and footwork, fending off the attack and immediately moving into counter-strike. Parry, then strike. Respond and strike. Sensing the opponent moving in, one responds at the very moment of their strike. This is timely defense. Parry the opponent's strikes like a willow bending in the wind, retreating left, then right, then immediately move to counterattack. Both Shikake and Oji move as one as they practice their techniques, unified in mind and spirit. The ample use of both left and right flowing techniques and corresponding defensive moves makes for a performance of beauty unique to Naginata form.
The All Japan Naginata Federation Kata is a grouping of traditional techniques refined into seven Naginata Kata. They make use of every type of maneuver included in the various Naginata styles, and their mastery calls for a high degree of technical prowess and equilibrium of mind.
Naginata is beloved by many people all over the country. This is the Kumamoto Budokan in Kumamoto City, an esteemed martial arts stadium with a long history. People of all ages train hard at this dojo, from first graders to adults. Even among children, those with more experience take the initiative in assisting their juniors. Four approaches are important to training in Naginata. To learn from one's instructor. To learn as a friend. To learn by watching others train. To take in the situation. One of the great appeals of Naginata is that practitioners can train side by side, helping each other progress, regardless of age. <laughs> Numerous tournaments are now held for Naginata, not only as a martial art, but also as a sport that is increasingly on the roster of official national sporting events. Naginata tournaments include the two categories of competitive matches and exhibition contests. Exhibition contests act as a forum to assess individual technique levels and also a stage for promulgation of proper Naginata form. Exhibition competitions include both the Federation Kata and the Shikake Oji style. Competitions are usually held either as tournament or league contests, through individual bouts or group events. In competitive matches, the contestants wear protective gear and compete to strike established areas of the opponent's body with the naginata. Naginata is a club activity at junior high and high school and colleges across the nation. At the annual Young People's Naginata Tournament, both exhibition contests and competitive matches are held. Recent years have seen an increase in male competitors, and now men's competitions are also held. The Naginata Club of this university has many male members, and its male and female members train together. All practice sessions are co-ed. With Naginata, physical strength and body size is not everything, so practice can be done without regard to gender differences. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
初心者で入ってもすごい分かりやすく説明してくださりますしかっこいいですね初めて試合見に行ってその決勝とかになったら動きがもう全然違くて男子はまだちょっと硬いんですけど女子とかすげえ柔らかくてなんかうちも速いし綺麗やしみたいなああいう女性なんか憧れます<笑>やっぱり技術も大事し技術を磨いていくのとやっぱ精神面でメンタルこう強い気持ちを持ってないと勝てないのでなんか普段は楽しくみんなでバイバイするけど勝負になったらしっかり勝負に向かって勝ちにこだわっていきたいなと思ってます。In practice sessions, students help each other out by critiquing each other. Regardless of gender or level of experience, these men and women are able to train and learn side by side. This is another wonderful aspect unique to Naginata. Naginata is passed down from generation to generation. Aya Yamauchi works as an instructor at a junior high school. A strong contender, she and a sister have previously won for Naginata at the National Athletic Meet. Influenced by their mother, a Naginata instructor, she began training at an early age along with her sisters. These sisters, giving each other support, have continued to train in Naginata and are now among Japan's leading Naginata champions. Today is a Naginata training day. After Aya's job is over, she makes her way to a city gymnasium. This is her older sister, Chiyo Yamamoto, who teaches this class. <laughs> the two of them are now mothers of young boys. Aya's son, Ryo, is now old enough to have taken an interest in Naginata. Chiyo's son, Ryuji, also takes part in practices. Chiyo is now a contender formidable enough to have already won the All Japan National Tournament. She is active not only as a competitor, but also as an instructor. The two sisters, taking after their mother in the practice of Naginata, have now become instructors themselves. In this way, Naginata is passed on from generation to generation.
Je monte tête. On a fait la fesse. On va By means of harmony, we are exalted. To find the path of humanity by way of intense engagement. This is the way of Budo arts. To train diligently, keeping in mind always harmony and courtesy. This is the way of the Naginata. <laughs> 